There's our max weight hog. Um, let's see if we can do it this time. Oh, welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing things a little bit different. I asked in the community and most of you say you want to see this. There's some maps I haven't explored too much of, whether I'm multiplayer or single player, just because I don't like them that much. And usually there's not a lot of multiplayer maps open for these ones, except for this one we're on. Most of you recognize it. This is Hirschfelden, and here's how much I have undiscovered. So there's quite a bit, and I know that's kind of sad because this is the first map, but we're going to fix it today. We're running around with the main loadout. One of you suggested doing guns we don't use all too often, and I really like that and would likely go with that in the next video. But not this one. This one, I just want to stick with it, mainly because we're still using the dog. I still want to get some stuff recovered. We just saw a level five fox and got a rooster to call a pheasant. I'm curious about both of those. I mean, that's just a level five, but it's nice to get them taken out so that they can respawn to something different. And it's alert, so let's go ahead and grab our 225. Drop that right in. Get over here and see. I should have spooked that rooster. I don't I don't see it flying though. Whoop. Nope, that's not it. That's just one of the regular birds. Some Canada geese flying overhead. And here's how bad I am. I'm just gonna try it again. I'm gonna always try it. Where's that three? There it was. I'm not sure what it is. I used to be able to hit those shots like crazy anymore. It just doesn't happen. That's all right. Let's go pick up this red fox. I'm really hoping to find something good. I mean, I know this map can hold good stuff. Good Euro bison. Good uh, fallow deer spot. Good red deer spot. Maybe a great one because I've killed just about everything on this map. And maybe one of our initial spawns will be that. I forgot about the roe deer too. Still need a diamond roe deer. Here's our fox, guy with a single lung from 146 meters. Our uh, roe deer's a little spooked at the moment. Speaking of fallow, there's one trotting away. We just came over, spooked him. I'm just gonna. Get as many shots into it as possible. Um, just because why not? We'll, uh, I don't want to chase stuff too long. So where were, ooh, is there something out there? Or was that a track? I think that was a track. Yeah, okay. That, that makes sense. Uh, but yeah, what I'm headed to is over here. Get that lookout picked up. It'll give us a good idea of what's around. Maybe another spot for an outpost. But in the meantime, this was a white 157. First shot missed, second shot made up for it. Glad all the others missed. Now, let's see here. What else can we find? This is something we haven't killed in a while, so I'm just gonna go for it. It is a red deer stag. Two shots. I think the second one connected. I'm not sure, but he's going down quick. The 1894 doing its job. And plenty more coming by. I know there's one other stag in there. I think he already went by us. And what do we have here? That's a hind. Oh, nope. Here he is. Well, I'll just... I'm going to get him down, I promise you. We'll just drop him until he stops moving. Uh, the other one's over here. Have I talked about how good the iron sights are on this 1894? Like, just such good iron sights. Love it. Here's our red stag. Red deer, 149. Small little level 5. Nothing fancy. We got another one to pick up over here. I'm sure he went down. And to be honest with you guys who are around, I'm going to be pretty indiscriminate. I won't show every kill. But this is kind of how it's going to go. I'm just going to round around. We see something. I'm going to kill it. We're going to get those uh, 
And get those respawns. That's what we're gonna go for. Where did this out? Uh, where did this stack go? And here's the other one. Another little guy. A level four. One nineteen sixty one. Tried him a bunch of times. Didn't hit a vital ever. Uh, just won't talk about it. Let's keep going. See what else we can find. Oh, well, I'll show you this next kill because that's a beautiful level eight big boy red stag. And again, going to use this model 1890. Uh, yeah, we got him. We got him. Just wanted to make sure. Uh, and let's see, where's he going? Still over there. Are there any others with him? I don't think so. I don't think so, but that's a nice big red stack. Big boy. I like it. Well, here's our big boy red stack. Let's see. Gold 219. Diamonds 251. I couldn't remember. Punch it through to the right lung all the way through. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful guy. Well, there goes a max weight left. Or, if I can hit him. I think we got him on that one. I don't think we got him good enough, though. Uh, doesn't look like we got him good enough. Must have just trailed off it. Oh, there's some roosters or some pheasants. That is a good pheasant. I know they're about to spook, bud. I know they're about to spook, Coco. I know. Let them spook. Let them fly to me. Now, we only have the 22, so this will make it interesting if we go for this guy. Oh, we got it. Nice. Nice. Now, that might have been grounded, but, I mean, we hit it. So, I'm not going to complain. And the hog is still alive, so... There is that. She's taking her time to pick it up. Bring it to us. Oh, we did get it. And it was a white brown gold. 1683 diamond is 20.29. We got him with the, that. Oh, that is... So awesome. I'm 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 impressed that I hit that shot and that it was not grounded at that point. Well our hog did go down and I did find him. I'm on the track of another max weight, so there was two in there. Would have been a gold 124.06. So not too bad that we messed him up. Uh, just hit a little high, which really isn't all that surprising, all things considered. Now the question is, is where is this other max weight hog? Or do I want to keep tracking him? Don't know his fur type. Let's find it right here. A light brown, nothing special. But is a... Uh-oh. They're fleeing. They're fleeing. Let's see if we can catch up to them. I don't know where they're going. It's more map to explore anyway, so why not? I think I found him. I just gotta see where he's at, because he's not with those four. There is a sleeping one there. Maybe, maybe that's not the herd, pack, whatever you call them, the wild hogs. But we have a level two, a uh, roe deer. That's the word I'm looking for, and we can use this gun on him, which is a little busted, if you ask me, to use that on them. <laughs> but it works. I mean, I'll take it. They're a small animal. That's a big, big caliber going into a small animal. That 44, mm, that's a big gun. Big old chunk of lead going into that animal, but that's all right. I'm not going to complain. I'll take them. And here he is here. Let's see what we get. A double lung. 
56.43. Small little guy. 81.86 is what we're looking for. Because like I said, I have not ever gotten a diamond roe deer. It is still on the list. So I've gotten an albino, believe, I believe. I do believe I've had an albino. It was a female, but that's okay. There's our max weight hog. Um, let's see if we can do it this time. Oh, easy. We are able to do it easily. I was trying to get... There goes the regular red stag. Nothing special. Uh, just keep trying to get up there to that outlook and keep getting distracted. I mean, we're just running around getting everything. Some roosters or some pheasants. Not even roosters going off down there. Here's our piggy. Another gold. This time with a great shot. 124.23. It's getting there. It's getting there. Apparently there's a rooster up here. He warning called me. Oh, there he goes. How are these not hitting? Thank you. Is it because I was still walking? Can you still walk while I aim down sights? Go and retrieve. There we go. There we go. Got it. Oh, you can. So I, I that might have been my issue. I still don't know why those weren't hitting, though. There he is. Silver. 15.18. Only. Oh, no, we hit him twice. Okay, so we did get him. We're used. I switched over to the 12 gauge, got away from the 22 LR simply because we're probably going to shoot at more pheasants than we are geese. And I would much rather shoot at pheasants over geese. Now, of course, I say that and some geese are landing. One of them was a level four and I'm not sure. He was a good size level four too. I'm not sure where he went off to. I'm pretty sure right in front of me. I'm almost positive he's landed right in front of me. So if I can pull out the right gun. Wowzers. And well, we got a we got a few, at least. We got this little guy, and a couple more went down as they were flying away. Brown hybrid, 6.13. All female. And see if he's gonna oops, go and retrieve, because there's some more to go get. There are more to go get. Well, here Coco comes with a goose for us. It's another one, a silver male, gray hybrid, or gray brown, gray brown, gray hybrid, gray brown. Good job. She's getting tired. I'm not sure. I think we killed more than that. Uh, I think we killed more than just those few. Looks like we got a few more. She didn't find anything. She is worn out. Let's sit her down and pet her up some. And we'll just go back to looking for some big game. Well, we found some more fallow deer. And I think we'll take one of them. Why not? I've kind of been running around. We started out up here, right? We discovered all that. Came down, we hit this, we're kind of running around over to here. See what we can find. A lot of pheasants, nothing good. Some red deer, roe deer, nothing good. Saw this follow deer. I know it's their drink time. That's just getting over because it is 1307. They finish up at 1300. And there's nothing good here. Nothing good at this lake, but that's okay. This guy here, 
was a small level three, another white. Yeah, a 175.14. I really want to get a big one of those guys. A big, big, big diamond. You know what I'm saying? A real big diamond. We're gonna go over here and hit that. Found ourselves some bison. For some reason, I thought 610 was max weight, but that's definitely not max weight. Definitely was looking. Hoping there's something good. And maybe. Maybe that's all we're going to get is that level two there. Um, and just because we can, it's not rated for them, but. Oops, I hit another one. <laughs> but that 44 just does work on them. So I'm going to take out a couple of them, I think. We hard shot that one. <laughs> oh man. I think I've talked about it before. I used to, or when we first started playing, my friend and I we were on Yukon Valley and just drove around on ATVs with double op buck and the shotguns and just did bison drives. I've really considered redoing that just because of how much fun it was. First shot, oh, got him in the neck and for some reason wasn't an insta down. So we didn't get a heart shot. It must have been that neck shot is what got that instant down. It just took a minute. And then this one, geez, look at that penetration, man. Nothing penetrates that way. I wish this was a level nine gun. I wish it was just like a three through nine. Just could take anything, Lee, uh, and get your full harvest check. Get the full metal, because that would be sweet. I think we're gonna wrap it up there. I've been trying to debate how I wanted to wrap up this video. I'm about to grab this outlook here and that's opened up a good bit of the map. We still have a little bit on the Southeast and a little bit in the central area to check out. So we'll come back to Hirschfeld and eventually explore some more ground. I've really enjoyed it actually. I've mainly just enjoyed playing the game without just hunting water zones. Just run around kind of like you do when you first get a map. You have to go around and really explore it. That's it's mainly why I've enjoyed this the most, I think. But real quick, guys, I just want to say, I don't say this enough. Thank you so much for your support. Watching my videos, sharing my videos, liking the videos, you know, doing all the things that you guys do. is just, it's outstanding. I am very grateful for each and every one of you that helped me help this channel grow, support me. Uh, it truly, from the bottom of my heart, is... A blessing so thank you and of course last but not least go enjoy a good home with a good friend i'll catch you in the next one